Hello there, my name is Yusuf and today I want to share with you some free text resources that I use for my projects. And uh, these are free resources where you can download uh, both PBR and just single image textures are to use for your project, all for free. Uh, so you can see in this project that I'm working on, uh, the project files will be available on my Patreon page and uh, the video is coming soon on the YouTube channel. Uh, you can see that I'm using this single image uh, to texture the wood surfaces of these image. And the way you use your single image, you just uh, get the image and then plug it into the diffuse and uh, use a car ramp to convert uh, to get a roughness map and a normal map from there. Uh, that's what I use. What, that is what is powering this image. So I got this image from uh, let's see uh, textures.com, which is a free website. It has a premium. I uh, pay a subscription uh, to download uh, all the textures you want for free. Uh, but uh, they also have a free a free uh, side of thing side of things where they give you 15 textures per day to download whatever you want so uh, you can see that i'm using my free account here and i've already downloaded about six images already six textures uh, actually i think is what i'm using for this project here and uh, yeah so you can just come in here and uh, download any text any textures uh, you want for free uh they give you only 15 per day if you want to get more than that a day uh, which i think 15 is enough uh, to use for a day you can get different textures uh, every day, single day until you get a good amount of textures you want to use for your projects and then we also have cc0 textures this is totally free you don't have to open up an account and uh, it gives you i think uh, these are all pbr textures so and uh, the way pbr textures work is to say you get you download at least i think four four to five images like this and uh, you just plug them to their corresponding input in their uh, in the principal bsdf uh, shader so you can see that i have uh, the base uh, the base color here uh, the metallic uh, connected to the metallic and the roughness uh, so that's uh, cc0 textures uh, textures.com also has pbr textures uh, if you want to download those you can also get those as well uh, then we have texture haven i'm sure you most of you know about this uh, i also offers uh, pbr textures for free uh, you don't have to open up an account i think it also owns as uh, uh, HDRI Heaven, where you can download HDRIs for your scenes. There is also this uh, uh, ShareTextures.com. Uh, it's also the same concept as Texture Heaven. Uh, you can support these uh, guys uh, by becoming patrons and uh, yeah, help them continue doing this. Uh, so uh, he also offers PBR textures. Basically, just you just download uh, the images and then plug them into the corresponding uh, PBR. Uh, inputs uh, like you see i've done here yeah so that's what i wanted to share with you and uh if you have noticed i'm creating a lot of assets uh, that i'm using for different projects and uh, these are all available to my patrons and you can see let me just see if i can uh, show you my how light my library is getting you can see um i'm starting to categorize uh, the different assets in two different folders uh, so that when blender launches their asset like the asset library they are working on uh, I'm not sure why it's taking too long but uh, when it's launched i will have quite a number of assets and uh, i'll be sharing this with my patrons so if you are want to uh, get some of these assets you can get the you can become a patron and request any of them i uh, will also be seeing me i won't be modeling everything from scratch from now on uh, since i since i've already started uh, since i already have quite a number of assets in my art in, in my library let me see, I think I have some books here that I can show off. Let me see. Yeah, this is what we have. Medieval books. Yeah, so like say this here, uh, these books, I can just reuse them for my library, for my scene here, since they fit uh, the theme I'm creating here. I'm just going to remove this spacing they have. Give them a quick rotation. I'm just going to add them into a collection, a new collection, call it books. Now I can just go to my to this scene here and just link them as 
think that under my um, decals, medieval books collection. Okay, uh, I don't think this is the one. File link. Because medieval books, it should be this. Hmm. Yeah. Now I can place them in my scene quite quite easily. And. Uh, Using the same project file here. Okay, let me just drag them, just copy them here directly. I'm not sure why they're not linking correctly, but. Uh, Then we have our books. Let me give this a quick cycle run and see how it looks. Yeah, thanks for watching.